was an Engineering 120 project, a freshman uh, introduction to engineering design, uh, and we worked all of the fall semester on it uh, as a team of six students. I'm working with the zookeepers here at the zoo to kind of figure out what they look for in an enrichment device, and then kind of through the semester we go through the design process, figure out what's going to work, um, narrow down our kind of brainstormed ideas, and then build our final prototype uh, to give to them at the end of the semester. We're looking at the rice enrichment device that the rice students made for us today. It consists of four pieces and the idea whenever we make enrichment is that it satisfies a specific goal. And in this case it happens to be foraging and problem solving. So what the students did is they had to make sure that this device will float and we wanted it to have four arms so that each of our four sea lions could be involved at the same time if we wanted. Our primary concern with our design, since we're working with the zoo and with live animals, is we always consider the animal safety first. And so right away that knocked out a lot of potential materials. You don't want to use metals, especially with water. Each section has a rotating collar that the sea lions must problem solve. And when they use their nose to push these pieces around, they can line up the hole to release fish or ice or toys that are found in these wells. I've never seen it used, no. We haven't seen it since we gave it to them in December. Do it, come on. All right, there you go. <laughs> okay, do they know what they're doing? Oh, oh they already got one. Okay. Got one. All right. Come on. Come on, get, get the, the fish. fish. Get, get the, fish. the fish. There they go. They know oh, do we make up. the hole not big enough? No, they can stick their noses yeah, in there. I can it. see that. Oh, oh, that he, saw, he, oh, he saw the other one. He just found the other one. <laughs> oh, guys. <laughs> they got yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's an ex interesting experience for us to think, to get to see how they react differently than we originally thought and how they can evolve after this. Maybe we come back one week later, a month later, they will change. One of the reasons I just really like rice is because it's like in downtown Houston, it has all these cool things around it. And the zoo definitely factored into my decision to come here just because I love going to the zoo. Okay, all right, all right. <laughs> Come on, guys. I see them messing with it. Extremely rewarding to have that partnership with Rice University. Uh, for me personally, reaching out to the students, teaching them uh, what are the safety aspects of building these kinds of enrichment devices. What is the goal? Uh, so it's not just about making a toy. It's actually about encouraging natural responses from our sea lions. So being able to impart that knowledge of why we do things um, and really fuse together the science of engineering to uh, the mental engagement of our California sea lions here at the Houston Zoo.